Hey YouTubers, Jesse here and I just want to show you a quick video on how to enable Bluetooth data pairing with an Android based smartphone and an Android 5.1 based smartwatch. Here we have the number one D6. So this device does not have great battery life. Uh, if you use Wi-Fi on it, it's gonna drain the battery pretty quick. So what we can do is we can use Bluetooth tethering to tether a data connection with the phone. Now mind you, it's very slow uh, when you're using that kind of connection method, but it works okay just for small data purposes or whatever you need to pull in data. So I've tested this out. Now there is some bugs uh, in the uh, the ROM on this device here and uh, sometimes Wi-Fi will turn itself on uh, by itself. Uh, not sure exactly why that happens there, so you'll see that. Uh, and I've tried to make sure that every setting for it would be off, but sometimes it will enable itself. But I, I can confirm that uh, Bluetooth tethering would work. And so this is how you're going to go ahead and do it. So the first thing you're going to want to go ahead and do is make sure that you have the, uh, the watch connected with your phone and uh, pair it up. So we're going to go ahead and open up the watch helper app here and it says no connection. So let's go ahead and tell it to connect and it's going to attempt to make a connection with the watch here. And so in our case of course it failed so let's go ahead and go in here and let's make sure that Bluetooth is actually enabled. And So in our case it's off even though it should have been enabled. So let's go ahead and try it again here. and still no connection so let's go ahead and select the device again well if you can get connected that is and and uh, there we go we are actually connected here finally great so we are connected and um, one thing you'll have to do of course in order to enable Bluetooth uh, pairing is you will have to go into the settings for your Android device and actually enable it. So we're going to go ahead and open up our settings here and you may or may not be able to see this very clearly. So in our case of course we have uh, our Wi-Fi control panel open here and you notice we're going to go ahead and go into advanced and when we go into advanced we're not going to see anything special or anything related to what we need here um, so just wanted to uh, to show you that there's nothing in there and uh, well basically of course I went into the wrong screen what the heck am I doing here sorry go into tethering and portable hotspot make sure that Bluetooth tethering is on uh, Bluetooth tethering is on and if you cannot get to this screen uh, in your uh, version of Android you can download apps from the Play Store that that will try to enable it to force it enabled for you so that's one thing to consider is, is uh, that you have uh, the uh, option to download apps anyway we're gonna go ahead and go back to the number one D6. So let's go ahead and go in here and make sure Wi Fi is off. And of course, it automatically turned it on for me, which is kind of weird. But uh, it should be off now. Its status is off. So we're going to go back. I'm going to go to Bluetooth. And when we select the gear for the Nexus, you notice this checkbox for internet access. And of course, for some reason, we lost our link. But you check that box for internet access. You hit OK, and then there you have it. So you're ready for uh, connectivity for data with Bluetooth. Now, notice Wi-Fi is supposedly off here. So let's go ahead and uh, give it a whirl, and we're going to see if we can uh, connect out to the internets. So let's go ahead and try an old classic. I always like to pull up AOL.com 
even though I uh, hate their services at the same time it's just a classic site that I know is always going to be up it's kind of a dead site but it works so there you have it we are connecting through Bluetooth for data and so that's going to save you a lot of power on this device um, in fact let's go ahead and just take a look and, and kinda of get an idea of where we're at on battery so we've been using this uh, all day here and uh, here we are